This video will be showing how to create a template for all your pages. That's called a background in Visio. So what we do is in your, for in your, as you create the your file, you click on the page tab. You're going to insert a page. You're going to set it as a background, and you see it's called the background. You can then specify your layout, your shadows, your drawing scale, your page size, anything you want it to apply to all pages. So we're going to set that. Now we want all our pages to have some kind of border. And so we're going to use this block to define the border of the page. Now I'm going to create a text box. And that's where we're going to put our document information. So we're going to make it left justified. So the title, we're going to insert a field, and we're going to specify the title of the document. And then insert field document info title, and then the date. We're going to make the date a another field, and we're going to say it was the last time it was edited. And so for title, first when you go to properties, say title of this document, and then you see that it's set there. You can also say page title. And we're going to insert a field page info, page name. And then we're going to say the author. And to do the author, you go back to file properties again. Now we insert creator. So that's the author name, and that specified by going to file properties author right here. Okay, great. Now we want this to be enclosed in a box. So we're going to get the shape and cover it. Now our text is hidden. So we're going to right click, shape, and then send backward. Now we see that that text box now is inside the box. Now we're going to format how we want this to look by bolding the each of the field headers. And I'm just using Control B for bold. You can also do it by pressing this. Okay, so we see that's our page background. Now we go to the page, go to File, Properties, File, Page Setup, set the page properties to use the background. Hit OK. And if we zoom and go to the bottom, we see that the page information updated. Now if we insert a new page, it'll automatically select that background. And if we zoom to the bottom, we'll see that the page updated. And that's how you create a background or a template in Visio.